are having a sister weekend in Beacon. <laughs> I am literally so excited because for people who don't know, Beacon is in the New York Hudson Valley area. Yeah. And we pretty much went to college in that area. So we are really obsessed with Love this them. specific area in New yeah. York. We actually highly recommend it for anyone who hasn't been. It is just the coziest like pocket full of cute towns and Beacon is actually one of my favorite ones, mm -hmm. but we've never stayed. No. So this is a first for us. Yeah, I know. We actually did get a little bit of a taste of it. Like a couple weeks back, we were in New Paltz and we, we went to breakfast in Beacon and we were like, we gotta make a weekend of it before the year ends. And we really are doing that. I know, I'm so freaking pumped. <laughs> yeah, so I'm really excited to explore and show some of our favorite spots and explore some new spots as well since we're gonna have the opportunity to do so. Yeah. but we're just gonna organize a little bit. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I need to get all this stuff in a more like better space for myself. Yeah. Just finished cleaning up. So now I think we're gonna relax before we go to this really cool place you wanna take me to? Yeah, I wanna take you to the Happy Valley Arcade Bar. I've been before, but you have not. And I've been dying to take her because I know it's something she, you would really love. Yeah. Um, Cause it's just got like nice 90s vibes and also good cocktails and drinks. So I figured that'd be a nice way to like start off or just kick off really the weekend, especially drinking. How how is the hot dog, Sam? Give it a rating. <laughs> just got back from the arcade, Yeah, washed our faces off, and now I'm ready to relax, drink some more wine, and have some snacks and watch a movie. Yeah, and don't forget the self-care. Face oh, mask, 100 steamer, mm -hmm. the works. We brought all the goodies, so we're just gonna like decompress and get ready for tomorrow. Yeah. <laughs> some cafes and shopping mm -hmm. and like check around the town but we need a little feel before going to cafe in my yeah mind. i know i need a little bit of food um and also we gotta start our day with some nice little affirmations mm. the self-care part of our weekend i don't know we if like you know this do. about us but we love a good tarot deck or just mm. like affirmation decks and these are like one of our favorite decks these Really cool crystal affirmation cards and these angel guidance cards. I think I want to do this one today. Yeah, I want to do an affirmation today. Okay. Ooh, fluorite. My intelligence allows me to make beneficial decisions. My intentions are pure and wholehearted. I agree. I like it. Okay. <laughs> Ooh, black tourmaline. This one. 
And it says, I free myself from what no longer serves me. I rest in my deep connection to earth. Oh, I like that. I like that. I haven't gotten this one yet, so that's cool. Mm -hmm. I like these. They're like so fun. <laughs> We're gonna go to a cafe because we're craving a little coffee to start the day. Yes, even though I made a little breakfast, it just wasn't enough. <laughs> no, no, I definitely want to treat. around a few shops and yes. thoroughly enjoyed ourselves yeah but now we're a little hungry so now yeah. we're thinking some pizza and beer at a local brewery that's right around the corner yeah which is like which i love about beacon it's all walkable oh, it's no, so i, know. I nice. haven't gotten my car once i love it <laughs> So we have no problem getting a reservation because it kind of was reservation only we didn't know until we called. But the food's supposed to be bought, so I'm really excited about that. We just got back from dinner yep. and we're just like reflecting on how much fun today was. Like we were just like hopping in and out of shops. We were just like having the best time ever. And like, can I just say, mm -hmm. I think the highlight for me was the cat cafe. <laughs> I know. I, I was missing my babies. Sat on my lap. I felt so chosen. It was like, it was a moment for sure. It but was. I'll never forget. And like dinner, it was actually so nice because we tried to go here yesterday, yeah. but we got rejected because there was no. We had to do a reservation. Yeah. So today we're like, we have to do a reservation. I just really want to check it out. And lucky for us, they they were able to sit us down, but we had to be outside, which I kind of I was fine. With, I thought it was honestly. super cozy. They still had heaters, so it was really, really nice. But now I am so ready to just like relax and play some games mm -hmm. and maybe edit a little bit. We'll see if I'm feeling ambitious, but yeah. that's pretty much the vibe for the rest of the night and can't wait for tomorrow. Yes. <laughs> leaving today. I know. I'm pretty sad, <laughs> but we had a really cute little cafe date. We did, for one, yeah. One last hurrah before I go. Yeah. Um, but no, but even though I'm leaving, Kristen's actually going to be safe for the next few days. So yes. we're, you're still, you're actually going to be kind of taking no, it over. I will be taking over the vlog for the next couple of days. Really only like two, three. Two? <laughs> Counts. Two or three days, um, which will be fun. But heads up, actually, I'm not going to be alone. Which is nice. Yeah, which I'm is not really leaving. nice. I'm not, I'm not like totally. totally <laughs> yeah, I'm not going to just ditch me in bacon. No. Uh, no, our older sister is with us actually, but out of respect for her, she does not like being in front of a camera She's a at all. Camera shy. A little camera shy. So out of respect for her, I will not be recording her. But no, I'm not alone. Um, but excited though to show you the rest of Beacon with some self care and other fun things. <laughs> Okay, so Caitlin is currently sleeping, so I figured I would treat her to coffee and a bagel to wake up. So hopefully she's awake so she can enjoy it, because if not, I will. <laughs> okay, part two of errands. We realize we're running out of wine and we need that to enjoy our charcuterie boards and some dinner, um, which is going to be later, but a lot of the stores are going to be closed because it's um, New Year's Eve. So I figured preemptively, let's go get all the snacks, all the things we need to get, and enjoy the rest of the day.
so we are officially done with three movies. Uh, so now we are going to do some tarot decks to kind of see what is going to happen for 2024, as well as do some more manifesting boards to just set some goals and intentions for the next year. Twenty twenty four isn't looking too bad, but I will. I had to do a little shout out. This kind of looks like my cat Elsa. It's probably one of my favorites in the deck too. Happy New Year! I didn't make it to me. Sleep early, which honestly is fine with me. Um, but today I am going to do Mount Beacon. I'm hiking today because I figure a lot of the stores are going to be closed, but also it would be a great way to start 2024. We are going to try to do this hike here and because we want to try to make it to the fire tower. But, okay, we're not halfway yet, but I wanted to show you a fun little thing just because, you know, just for new hikers. Uh, so I'm following the red trail. It should only take us about two and a half hours is what we were told. So you want to see this if you want to do our hike. So you're going to notice these little red markers all over the trees. Pay, I'm paying attention because if we divert, it's going to be a longer trail, which is what I do not want to do today. Okay, it's snack time for me. And I just got these. They're pretty good. I'm a huge like mango person, so I like dried fruit on hikes. It's probably like my favorite sort of like sweetness, but also like kind of gives me energy when I'm like walking around because I have a sweet tooth, but absolutely love. That thing over there is where we're trying to get to. Beacon weekend is officially over. I'm sad, but also like it was so much fun. I can't wait to definitely I'll come back and do it again. Uh, but before we go home, uh, we decided to go check out our old campus. Uh, Maris College is where we all went in the Hudson Valley area. Uh, and so we figured just walk around campus, enjoy the day since it's gorgeous out, and then attempt to maybe go to the bookstore and get some new sweatshirts. We'll see if they're open. Hopefully crossing fingers. <laughs> This was Shannon and I's building. 
that we were in freshman year, Marion 205. Oh, the memories that I can say I can't remember. 